Hello and welcome to another Photoshop Elements tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to cover sharpening with the high pass filter. Okay, we're going to use this picture right here, mostly for one reason. This picture has a very low or a very high depth of field. There's not a lot that's out of focus in here. There's a lot of sharp edges and consequently it will respond well to the sharpening. Now, there is a sharpening filter in Photoshop, but we're not going to use that mostly because it's not quite as controllable as this process. Now, first thing we're going to do is we're going to duplicate the layer. Just drag down the layer to the new layer option. It will duplicate it. What we're going to do is we're going to go to Filter, High Pass, which is under your Others. And we're going to keep this low, and we're just going to pick up the outlines like here. I had about three pixels working for my image here. You might have to make it smaller based on your image resolution, etc. But we're going to stack right around three for this one. Okay. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to change the blending mode to Soft Light. And if I toggle the layer on and off, you can see it sharpened up some of the leaves a bit, the sign, and this post. Now, if this isn't quite enough, what we can do is we can duplicate this layer. If we duplicate it while it's blended in soft light, it'll duplicate the exact settings, including its blending mode. So we can keep doing this, and we can continue to sharpen this up. The one thing you do have to be careful with, now this is a relatively low noise fo photo, but if you have larger ISO settings, the noise will tend to increase at quite a rapid rate the more times you duplicate your layers here. Okay, now that's basically it here. But one thing that's important about this is if you do start to pick up like noise where you don't want to, you can um, sample the background color and then with a paintbrush paint away some of the noise you don't want or um, any details that you don't want sharpened. Let's say we don't want this lamppost here or this thing here. And then what it'll do is the rest of it will be sharpened and it won't. Well, thanks for watching, and this has been another Photoshop Elements tutorial.